Christopher Keeley is currently being held in Miami, Florida, where he's waiting for a hearing. After that, he'll return here to Massachusetts to face charges. I feel safer. A four day search by police ending 1500 miles away in Miami Beach, Florida. Authorities finding 27 year old Christopher Keeley there wanted in connection to the brutal double homicide of Marshfield couple Carl and Vicki Madsen. It's just kind of really sad what happened. I was actually kind of freaked out. This is where police say they found Keeley in Miami. The fugitive seeming to change his appearance while on the run, donning red hair in his booking photo by Miami Beach police. It's just crazy that he was like ready to be like on the run. Someone called in a welfare check on the Matsons. When authorities arrived to their Gotham Hill Drive home Tuesday night, they found the two 70 year olds bludgeoned and stabbed to death. I think it's just really surprising that something can happen in like a small town. Well, South Shore is a very safe area. We don't see this type of stuff. Police believe Keeley stole the victim's Jeep Wrangler, finding it abandoned in Avon one day after the Matsons bodies were found. No word yet on how they believe Keeley was able to make it all the way to Miami Florida. He's just like a maniac and it's just crazy that there's people around us like every day. Police have made it very clear that this appears to be a targeted attack. The medical examiner is currently trying to figure out when exactly the Matsons were killed. In Boston, Danae Bucci, WCVB News Center 5.